Hey, welcome back to Crit Catch. I'm Michael. And I'm Skyler. And we just got Jenny back. Now I'm part of our crew. Uh, you were asking if we could like if there were any like old school horror games. I'm like, we played Shadowgate last. You know, that was kind of horror-y, but like it was just a horror game because, like, your stomach got upset that one time. Or well, I mean, yeah, yeah just... I mean that's that's I mean that's not. Wow, I would hate to work in this office. <laughs> like, it's like, hey, could you go grab that thing I just printed? To be like, you're fucking kidding, right? You know, there's no uh, floor. Like, yeah. literally, there's no floor on on the printer level, right? Yeah. Like, there's just fucking spikes and Blinky died. Yeah. <laughs> Can't. No. Um, <laughs> what kind of fucking HR nightmare is this yeah, office? Jeremy like, and Velasquez have both died. Like, <laughs> it's the reason we fucking hired you. <laughs> the fucking shitbird admiral won't let us have a union, so there's no goddamn floors. <laughs> I don't know why that made me laugh so much. It's not like an original joke. Dude. <laughs> hmm. You might be fucked. Nah, I got this. <laughs> yeah! That was, that was, Go Blinky! Yeah, that was really close. Oh, that was almost worse, actually. I almost <laughs> just slid right off the fucking thing. Uh, I'm not gonna go for that, I don't think. I'm okay. Yeah. Okay, um... <laughs> they call me Blinky, and I have a jetpack in my asshole. <laughs> I'm not that's, sure why they decided it that way. That's where it was plugged in, like, it was the only place I had an expansion port. Uh, Fuck! <laughs> Pew! Um, let's see. Universal cereal butt. <laughs> God damn it. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> just, I'll be here for 10 more minutes. <laughs> just fucking, I need some data transfer to zip. Fuck. <laughs> that's not how that's supposed to work. Were you having trouble with that jump? No, I was <laughs> just thinking about the universal cereal butt. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, so as far as old school horror games go, like... There are games that kind of have that ambiance, but like I wouldn't say you know part of it's that the tension in horror is really hard to capture in So there's actually a maze element to this. It's a slight one, but like there's actually multiple exits from a lot of these Fuck you do, ground. Yeah. There's a lot of like multiple little God. exits from these cor from the different sides of this space. Um Go like when I crunch ice. Yeah. <laughs> This is the most hilarious one. Um, I actually think I could break all of these because I don't think Willie actually leaves his cell. Um, Why is this one hilarious? Because of this. Because he sucks? <laughs> Just because he's a dumbass. Is this the thumber it shoots nails? <laughs> it's actually really strong. Yeah. As the thumb often is. Yeah. Um, Again, start with the pinky. Especially when you put it in the universal cereal butt. Hashtag, <laughs> look, hashtag start with the pinky. And remember... Stop trying to start that hashtag. And remember... That's not okay. There's never enough lube. Hashtag never enough lube. Uh, that's not what this show is about. <clears throat> I guess that's what Bucky O'Hara is about, I guess. Yeah. But, that's um... What this show's about. Um, alrighty. Um... What's up, <laughs> Willie? What's up, Willie? Thank you. Did I maybe caught at the top? Maybe caught at the top. Oh, I guess. Are you still Fuck shooting him? <laughs> Fuck you, Willie. Get your thumber out of here. Um. Yeah, the, the oh, ambiance. I know that you say. Okay, so so we can actually see Willie. So Willie, um, to explain why he looks the way he does in the show that we touched on this a little bit earlier, but the, in the in the story, he's actually from Earth, and he's like a super smart kid, and he built this like. He's a kid. Yeah, he's like a twelve-year-old. And he built a photon accelerator, which Should maybe stop it with these jokes I've been making. Whoops! <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 um, but uh, he uh, he built a photon accelerator, not proton, photon, and uh, he switched it on like at the same time like Blinky switched on. Uh, Blinky switched on. The photon accelerator on the on their ship at and there was like a there was a some sort of issue with it, uh, and he got warped into this world at the same time that um, I think his name is like Bruiser, 
uh, like gorilla. He was like this like robo gorilla. Like he basically got vaporized. Or, like he fucking dies. Yeah, and so Willie's wearing like this mechanical ape suit that's like, and he's he basically is disguised. Like he has a helmet that's like an ape as well. Um, so he's like this berserker ape, and nobody knows he's a human except the crew of Bucky's ship. Wow. Okay. Um... Ah, damn it. Oh. <sighs> yeah, this is... I actually have to pay attention to the timings on these little blocks. Yeah, I can talk for a while. That's good. Yeah, You know, honestly, like, because we were talking about horror games, too. Um, besides being a gigantic gorilla that gets vaporized, that fucking sucks. But, Jesus... This yeah, that's complicated. Well, and yeah, and like, I'm really good at doing this just when I'm just paying attention to it. Yeah. There, there was a little Trying bit of like, talk, mm, yeah. yeah, it's messing my timing up. Now, anyway, um, you go ahead. Yeah. Uh, do you remember the N64 game Star Wars Shadows Over the Empire? Yeah, I have it in a, one of my drawers somewhere here. Okay. Uh, the game drawers. The, God damn it. <laughs> the, uh, <laughs> let it out, let it out. <laughs> The, uh, there was a... This is really hard to do with... No, keep just keep talking. Just keep <laughs> talking. You, you just talk. You just talk. I'm going to pay attention to this. <laughs> Sounds good. There was this level... Um, so, one, I, I loved that game. I played through it multiple, multiple times. Um, but there was... <laughs> there was one... Uh, uh, I wish y'all could see him, like, kick it every time <laughs> he dies. There was this... There's this, like level and it was like this like swampy complex and there's just this dirty shit water and you'd had to eventually swim through the dirty shit water effectively and um i don't know they looked like just floating kidneys i don't know what the fuck they were but they just made this like noise and they would swim at you in the water that you couldn't see shit in and it was just the most fu like it just freaked me the fuck out as a kid i don't know why <laughs> And, like, I've actually, I have a thing with, like, uh, like water I can't see through has been a problem for me ever since then. Like, and it was because of this fucking Star Wars game on the goddamn N64. That game also had one of the longest, like, train levels. You had to, because I don't remember the... I don't remember the guy's name, but he was a an android assassin guy. IG88. Yep, that'd be the one. <laughs> um, well, that just seems silly. Yeah, this one's funny because you actually like unless you're standing completely on the wrong one, you can't die. Yeah. Like, I just put the different weight on the different feet, and I'm fine. <laughs> uh, he's just like a teddy bear. Blinky. Oh yeah, he's super cool. Oh, uh, now we're actually gonna. Uh oh. Okay, these will actually one-shot you if you get hit by them. Uh, can uh, can uh, Boy Wonder not? Um, can he actually? Uh, huh? Can he not aim up? No, only uh, only uh, Bucky can aim up. Okay. Bucky. Captain Captain Bucky. Bucky oh here. God! I thought I was just gonna like keep going. Yeah, no. This is actually like way, this part is way less threatening than it seems. Yeah, it looks terrifying. Uh, Whoever constructed the toad ship is an asshole. What? The rock hit me and I fucking died. <laughs> I actually like took damage from the rock. I just, and I fucking died. Yeah, this is, like, really weird just on account of, like I said, like, when I'm playing this, I mean, not, different. not trying to talk, like, okay, I'm just going to eat that, fuck it. Um, like, I've lost so many more lives than I should have by at this point. Oh, yeah, um, okay. Mostly, so the game is actually, like, really forgiving with continues and stuff. It's mostly that I don't want to have to continue because <laughs> you lose your, like, power bars. Oh, really? Well, and it's... It, so so it's, it's, like, diminishing returns, basically. Yeah, it's not the biggest deal. Um, oh, ah. oh, yeah, it's not the... Oh, it's, man. It's not the biggest deal um, if you if it happens toward the end of the game. Uh, because like the power bar stops mattering um, after oh, a certain you point. These anymore, can you? Um, no, who, this is just who this designed is, this elevator. This goes back to like the Toad HR shit. Like 
Like, there's not like a fucking OSHA in space. Like, yep. there's no like. Uh, uh, yeah, it looks pretty tight. <laughs> Like, I remember, so this is, like, a kind of a terrible story, but, like, um, one of the universities we went to, uh, there was a, they were building a new building, and a crane fell over, and two guys died while they were building oh, this God. new building. Yeah. And, you know, that led to, like, this huge, like, six-month delay, and... Well, because uh, there was, like, a whole investigation. Oh, yeah, and that was part yeah. of the, like, making... Because, sh- basically, it's, I mean, we live in Dallas, and... Uh, they know. <laughs> it, it, yeah, but it gets, like, really windy. Um, cause we're like North Texas, like, Oh, it's just flat as fuck. Yeah. There's like yeah. planes. It's part of why like tornadoes are like a big problem here and whatever. Um, see an asshole. Oh, I mean, it, it's just like the last one. Yeah. Um, but, uh, this, no, actually this is super, this is also super easy. Um, but so like, you know, the wind blew it over and I mean, it was, it was, no one was at fault. There was no like safety violations here. You can actually see him cl- crawl up a wall like we haven't done yet. Um, there were no safety violations or anything. When he does that. But, um, you know, it was this huge investigation, like, took a super, like, it knocked the the construction, like, had to shut down for, like, I don't know, six or eight months or something like that. Well, because it moved the final, well, because they were deconstructing the crane. Yeah, because the they thing. they had to make sure that the, that the crane was up to code and everything. So, like, so, yeah, horrible, horrible story. And oop, I just looked at the timer and jumped into a shot. Um, and it's not to make light of that, but it's, uh, you know, just, just the kind of general concept of like these types of things being constructed. And that's like something that never really gets talked about because you have like these galactic empires and things like that. Like somewhere in their bureaucracy, (laughs) everybody's all right. Sorry. I just completely like flipped off of that discussion. Yes, that's right. Deadeye. Come on. Um, Oh, that's the end of the stage. Cool. But yeah, yeah, these like galactic empires and like somewhere in the bureaucracy of like the Star Wars world, like there has to be some sort of safety protocol. I mean, yeah, like they're dumbasses and oh, okay. Hang on. Captain, what should we do? We have to escape, Danny. Now. You need to like prep yourself for that. Like- yeah, this is weird. Like, yeah, well, the tooth thing is weird. Like, fuck me. Well, where are we now? <laughs> I calculate we are near the core of the magma tanker. Seems like a reasonable thing to put in a tanker. You know, if I'm going to design a spaceship, Let's I'm gonna... follow the salvage chute down to the center. Then we can blow their tanks. <laughs> Yo, Bucky. Let's ionize the slime-eating toadies. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, look, it's <laughs> L6M again. What was the... Well, six em. Six em. Uh, oh, uh, what is he writing? I, yeah, this is thing's... that his gimp? Like, what is this? This thing's fucking annoying. Um. Uh, but so, like, yeah, like the, the whole like Star Wars or any of this shit, like somewhere in the in the creation of like an intergalactic empire, like someone at some point, you know, had to. God damn it! I knew that was gonna happen. That looks like a job for Blinky. Oh, and. You can jump over that. I just wanted that power coin, and I was greedy and lazy about it. <sighs> I I just don't understand what he's writing. Huh? He's not writing anything. He's inside a monkey suit. No, 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 no. The little guy you just killed. Oh, so that thing actually splits into three different, like, flying whatevers. It's really actually super fucking annoying. Um... <sighs> So all Willie does is charge up and shoot stronger. Yeah. It's actually, like, super useful in a couple of instances. Um, there you go. Where is this asshole? There you are. Okay. No, oh, damn it. <laughs> yeah! Wow. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> that was lucky. <laughs> no, actually, um, I did that last night, too. Did you? Yeah, <laughs> I knew you could do that. <laughs> Um, but, uh, actually, um, next time on Crick, we're about 14 and a half minutes and there's next sections. Is it going to get wild? Eh, nah, fuck it. It's not super wild. Okay. Oh, I was expecting like lava to pour. No, from the- there's another little kind of like controlled fall section right here that you got to be careful about because the touching the tips of these things will absolutely like 
destroy you. Yeah, I always have um, to tell my partners that warning. <sighs> this is just my thing. Oh god, okay. <laughs> Oh, that's yeah. There oh. it is. There it is. All right. <laughs> His dead body fell. <laughs> yeah. All right. Next time on Crit Catch, we'll get back to this bullshit. Oh, there's something kind of sad about that. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah.